Are you sure all the power is on? We're back up. Everything is good. During that hurricane, I was having Xbox withdrawal. I actually had this idea. What's that? Are you listening to me? Even though I'm playing, I I'm that kind of dude. I can play this game and talk at the same time. So this is my idea. This motherfucker thought he was going to shoot me. Go ahead, talk, talk, talk. Oh, don't do that right now. Right now, I could die. Oh, no! Damn it! So this is my idea. Ever since I helped out with Salvation Army, I was thinking, since I'm not doing Club Spartacus until I come back from Vegas, to keep that name alive, let's throw a fundraiser for the dogs that were separated from their owners during Hurricane Sandy in honor of Club Spartacus. And when do you plan on doing this? This week. Ah! Hurricane Sandy didn't just affect people, it displaced a lot of dogs as well. Even though I'm leaving for Vegas in a couple of days, I feel like this is my last chance to help in some way give back to the pups. If I'm gonna do something, I gotta do it now. I mean, I have to go to Vegas next week. It's an honorable idea. Can you pull it off in a couple of days? I don't know. I mean, I'm up for a challenge, you know I am. Okay, next question is what do I have to do? Nothing. I think it's a great idea. We're here tonight to give Coco our blessing. She's about yes. to embark on this show. Yeah. She starts rehearsal. She'll be out of here in about a week. Coco. Viva Las Vegas, Viva Las Vegas. Las Vegas, yes. they're not ready for Coco. <laughs> yes. I'm gonna miss you, boo. Oh I'm my gonna God. miss you. I'm, I'm gonna, miss gonna so miss New York. I've been like- Every time I say I'm gonna miss her, she goes, I miss New York. <laughs> no. <Her low> life. <laughs> it's like, there's a whole life here. Right. And it's like, my life isn't in Vegas. My heart's here, including you. This was an offer you couldn't refuse. It was kind of like, this is as big as it gets. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm building myself up. Is this yeah. about leaving? Yeah. Yeah, it's about leaving. It's so. my heart. I'm really excited about this opportunity, but I'm really nervous. Ever since I met Ice, he has been by my side every step of the way of my career. This is the first time I'll be without him with, with nobody. I want to give this to you because oh, I don't gifts. know when I'm going to see you. I want to make sure that she doesn't replace me. God. Oh. This is little and you can take it with you to Vegas. Friends, our angels who lift us up to our feet when our own wings have trouble remembering how to fly. I'm really going to miss you. Cry. I'm so proud of you for going and taking this chance. I know you were afraid to at first. Like, oh, but you have to remember. Can I do it? Everyone that loves you, we're all going to be here. We're only a phone call away. Yeah. Thank you. It's going to be hard to leave for Vegas, but it makes it a little easier knowing there's so much love and support waiting for me back home. Have another toast to Coco. To Coco! Want my cherry? I love that cherry. You want it? <laughs> <laughs> ah. <Business> Ooh. <laughs> oh, alcohol. <laughs> I knew I'd get you to drink. I feel a little buzz. <laughs> we need a little buzz because we need to go over some serious yes. business here. Okay, one thing we gotta discuss is Club Spartacus. Okay. We're helping raise money. Right. For these little creatures. Right. I think this is a cool idea. Club Spartacus, to me, is a social club for both humans and animals. Since I can't get the full Club Spartacus up and running for business before I go to Vegas, I figure, okay, maybe I can just do a pop-up club. But do it for a good cause. Do it for Hurricane Sandy. Okay, got it. So time is really ticking down. This week, I'm going to be doing nothing but rehearsing. I won't be able to do any of this, so you're just gonna be like my go-to man, okay? okay. This is definitely a 24-7 job, and yes. you're on it. You know what? You're gonna have to be on call all the time. Okay, no, I'm with it. That's no just... sleep. Hey, 
Hey, baby. I've been stuck in the tunnel. I've literally just sat there for hours. How can I not stress? Now they're gonna think that I'm incapable of being on time. This is my first day of rehearsal and I hate being late. I'm gonna be rehearsing with Jerry Mitchell. He's Mr. Broadway. He's a Tony Award winner. He's done everything from Legally Blonde to Hairspray. Last thing that I wanna do is start off on the wrong foot. Five, six, seven, eight, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Oh. I've arrived. <laughs> let's, um, let's get started. Okay. I wanna play around a little okay. bit with you and find out how you move and what you do. I have Nick and Paula teach you a little section of the finale okay. just to see where you are. Come on over here. This is the big finale number where Bo Peep arrives in all of her glory. So it goes one, two. On three, it's you're pushing your left shoulder down and your head goes whack. Wait, do it again, do it again. Yeah. From the top, one, one two, two, have all Okay, so you, so I'm missing a beat there. Yes, okay. yes, yeah. So, so it, Step together. Uh, pop. Oh, shoot. Let's go yeah. from the top. Six, seven, and. No. Do it again. When I was younger, I danced for fun, but this time around, it's business. Jerry's entrusting me to be the lead. I'm doing the best that I can, but I feel so out of practice. One, two, kiss fist. One, two, kiss fist. One more time. Those who run. Seem to have all the fun. Oh, thank you. The fun. A little faster, and... Oh, Watch Paula do it once. Just watch how tight she does it. Seven, and one, two, three, four. Fa uh, uh, uh. This choreography is harder than anything I've ever done in my life. These are really, really good dancers. I think I'm in way over my head. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna leave you with Paula okay. and Nick to help start teaching you some really basic stuff in okay. the show. And then I'll see you tomorrow and we'll start working on the new number. So okay. with the last number you're, you're showing me, is there more to that? Oh yeah. We're gonna take it to another level. Okay. Five, six, seven, and one, two. Fun. That's it. My first day of rehearsal was a little shaky, but I've been working so hard. And I think it's really paying off. I'm finally feeling in sync with the moves, and I'm getting so comfortable with these guys. Oh, somebody sore? Oh, yes, I'm so sore. My, my neck and my lower back. Welcome to our world. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very flexible, you know, and I like, I do aerial yoga. We're doing all this great stuff, but like, what if we like just bust out like at the end or something and like, boom, boom. What? Well, I say yes. <laughs> I think that is an amazing move and we should figure out a way to put that in, yeah. definitely. I am so excited that I can contribute to the show by adding my famous splits. Jerry is gonna choreograph a whole new number around my moves, so dope. I'm practicing now. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's not. Oh, come on, girls. You're feeling it. That rehearsal was everything. I know. I felt like I was watching you in the music video. I was like, look at Coco getting hot. Like, so when we're at a club, we could bust it out. Yes, yes. Uh, <laughs> speaking of club, what's going on with Club Spartacus? We're reaching out to everybody, and we can have the red carpet, right, for the dogs, and then have a nice ice sculpture with Spargus and Maximus, they Maybe. see elegance. I love Solji with all my heart. He likes to go big, but we can't be spending all our money on custom ice sculptures. We'll have no money for charity at the end of the day. If right. you make it too flashy, then they'll be like, okay, so why didn't you just give them money? I would just do a little tweaking. Why, why don't we just call Mariah Carey? I mean, geez. We can call her too. Look at this, this dog, you train him well. Pa, Max, Pa, no Pa? Pa? Good uh. boy, that's a good boy. <laughs> so you tired, Coco? 
I've been wearing ballroom shoes for mm -hmm. six hours, and but my feet are achy. I thought that would be the last thing I'd have to worry about. I like practically live in hills. Are you kidding? Mm -hmm. Oh, my butt kills. But I'm feeling really good. I'm excited. I'm having so much fun with this. Yeah. I just feel like almost guilty. I'm leaving you and everything behind. It's three months, okay? At the end of the day, you're handling your business, you're doing what you want to do, and it's like a vacation. Look at it like a working vacation. What's going to fall apart? Delicious. Delicious is up and running. Park. Delicious is up and running. The dog park hadn't even started. You got to clear your mind. I understand that we don't want to be broke up and miss, get away from each other, but we're going to handle that. You know what I'm saying? I'm coming up with all these excuses why it's hard to leave New York, but the real reason is I don't want to leave ICE. Honestly, I'm trying to process this all myself, and I just, I just don't know what I'm feeling. You can make this move, you know, I know right now. I can make the move. I'm just letting you know. I'm venting right now. I'm just basically telling you what's inside my head. I just got to make sure I deal with it correctly. Got it? You're venting. Thank you. This is kind of putting a little dent in my boo. See how it does that this, dent? This or this, this? This right here. I'm leaving for Vegas and it's time to get fitted for the Little Bo Peep costume. Little Bo Peep is the central character of the show. It's a story of a workaholic who magically awakes to a journey of self-discovery. Holly Madison made this role famous and now I'm stepping into her shoes and her corset. Right, right? exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That's beautiful. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hey, what's Hi. up, boss? How are you? Really nice to meet you. All right, cool. Good. They've made cool. this, they made it from scratch. It looks cool. She's been practicing. She is. <laughs> Can't stop practicing. <laughs> well, this is a fitting, right? Yeah. Well, it fits. <laughs> nah, it's, it's hot. It's dope. You're going to be wearing that for three months, girl. I was giving you a Bo Peep reaction. I got that Bo Peep reaction. But we'll do it again. On B and side six, seven, eight. <laughs> Can you believe that, though? You're going to be doing this six days a week for three months. Yeah, and on the weekends, it'll be two times. I can honestly say that's harder than I've ever actually had to perform live. I'm proud of Coco. This will raise her um, star, you know, in the world. People will see her differently. I just know that this is just going to be a phenomenal moment in her life. And I always tell you, I got all my accolades early, so I'm kind of cool. It's, now it's fun to watch you win. But you're going to be doing this on your own. I'm going to be here. This one is 110% Coco. I always told you there's no such thing as luck. Luck is when opportunity meets preparation, so you have to be careful what you wish for. Point of no return. This is the point of no return. You ready? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you guys going through my purse again? There's no snacks in there. I have no snacks today. You guys get you out of my purse. You guys are hungry today, right? Well, speaking of that, these are the treats for the event. So I guess being that these guys are hungry, they can test it out. All right, let me see them. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> We're about to do Club Spartacus night, and Solji's locking in all the details. I'm really excited because if you had a week like mine, a friend like Solji really makes it all possible. Okay, okay, excuse me. <laughs> so these are the biscuits and stuff these that's gonna biscuits. be. And we're gonna have the waiters walking around, passing them out to the dogs. Okay. So it's gonna be like. Okay, mom needs to try it first. Okay. You need to try what? To try this. You wanna eat it? <laughs> mm. <laughs> that is not for humans. Okay, so you got the red carpet. You got the DJ. You got the biscuits. I feel like they're. It's like something missing. Maybe we can do some little dog decorations. I got an idea. It's sitting right in front of us. Yes, this works. Oh, let's make it happen. OK. Yeah. Wow. Looks great, right? Solji did an amazing job. 
from the room that he picked out to the decorations to the food, everything was perfect. And we've already got people waiting outside. So let the party begin. Welcome to Club Spartacus! <laughs> Oh my goodness! Doll treats! <laughs> Doll treats! That, right? I love your outfit. I love your outfit. We kind of match, right? actually. Yeah. Right? Oh my god! Is this like so cute or what? You know what? I love going places with my dog. Love yeah. And this kind of combines everything I love in yes. one place, so we can both go out together. I don't feel guilty about leaving her alone. Yes. Our pop-up club Spartacus is kicking. We're raising money. All dogs from around New York City are coming to party with us. It's so much bigger than I thought. Oh, what a lot. Oh. This hey, is babe. wild, Coach. <laughs> a little nice little turnout. Look at people brought food. We got checks for the, the you know, Hurricane Sandy. I mean, right. what more can you ask for? You gotta remember, you threw this in two days. It's amazing what can be done when it's gotta be done. Soji. So what do you think about the first dog club? I love it. <laughs> and this is a guy that's scared of dogs. Thanks for helping Coco, because she's crunching right now trying to leave. Yeah. And I leave it up to Solji. He always comes in for me. Yes. Hey, Look at this guy. He's tired. Are you tired, Max, baby? Max, you find some loving? Are you tired, baby? You find your woman? He's like, I ain't done. I'm still looking. Max, in the club life, sometimes you go home with no numbers. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Take it home. He's like, <laughs> and live the club another day. This club Spartacus night is going off without a hitch. I'm happy, but this is like the last hurrah with my friends in ICE. I'm just not ready to leave. Hi, guys. Hello. Hi. It's the last day today. I know. I don't want it to end. The goal today is to do everything so many times mm -hmm. that you don't have to think about it. Yeah. But we do have a little something for you. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, I'm official. Yay. Yes. That's awesome. It's my final rehearsal before I go to Vegas and I'm really getting my confidence on with these moves. Yeah. Yeah. After I got it and I started just naturally doing it without thinking about it, it was amazing. I'd say you're ready for Vegas. You're ready, Yay. Vegas. You are gonna blow them away. I mean it. You think so? I mean it. The town isn't ready for this. I'm excited to meet the girls. Everybody at the theater is going to fall in love with you. Oh. And they're going to be cheering you on because this is amazing what you're doing. This is so fun. You are dancing the out of this. Finally, I'm getting it. It's, I'm not, we're not bullshit here. No. <laughs> I can't wait for Vegas to see Coco. really difficult for me right now. It's not just about packing. It's leaving ice. I'm starting something totally new without him. Wow. How are you coming? You just were real quiet up here. I wasn't hearing you for a while, so I came and checked on you. This is a bit sad. I was just thinking this before I started taking clothes away. This is the last time I'm going to see it like this. When I do come back to New Jersey, I won't be coming back to this home. So it's really devastating to me. What's the matter? You know, I've been on edge, honey. Edge about what? About everything. Everything what? About leaving. You know I miss you, baby. You know I miss you. Shh, don't even look at me like that. You don't want to leave your closet. No, but it's everything. What is everything? You're taking your dogs. You're taking all your clothes. It has nothing to do with my closet. It's just, I'm like really starting another chapter in my life. Mm-hmm. But I got you. Mm-hmm. And I 
know this is my choice. It's just, remember I told you it's taking that step off. That's really scary. Mm -hmm. I'm taking my step off right now. You can pull that off though, right? You'll be able to hang. I miss you. I miss you too. I don't want you to go. I'm a hate it. But at the end of the day, we made a decision we were going to pull it off together, right? Mm -hmm. It's probably just sinking in because you're packing your bags. And it's been a long time. You've been out here in New York all these years. It's like you have never really been gone this long. I hope I made the right decision. You think I made the right decision? On the season finale of Ice Loves Coco. <sighs> Here I go. Welcome to Vegas. All right, Coco, it's time for you to learn the silk. Oh my God, my hands are sweating right now. You know I want to be there for your opening night, but I'm not coming. It's kind of strange that Ice is not going to be here. She has so much on her mind. Uh, with Ice not coming, I don't think I'm ready. 